Hi, I'm Quindor from Intermittent Technologies, and I wanted to talk to you about a project I've been working on behind the scenes. The project is called The Road to Ryzen. And basically what it means is that I've decided that my current Core i7-4770K is ready to be replaced after three years. Although it's still plenty fast for most tasks, especially during video editing and rendering and stuff like that, some more cores would come in handy. In the past, my builds have been either Intel or AMD. What else is there nowadays? But basically, I think for almost 10 years or so, they've been only Intel because, well, AMD just hasn't released anything interesting anymore for enthusiast builders. But with the introduction of Zen, or Ryzen, as it's now called, that is hopefully, if you can believe the rumors, going to change. I still remember the good old days of the AMD Athlon X2 or the AMD Thunderbirds. Those are some really exciting times with CPU innovations and CPUs really getting faster every year. Lately though, nothing much has happened, since basically AMD decided, meh, let's give up on high end. Intel hasn't had a real reason to innovate anymore. Their last CPU refresh, the KB Lake, it had about a 1% improvement in IPC or performance basically. Yeah, if there's no competition, why, why should they try, I guess? So, I'm going to take the gamble. And I'm going to build an AMD Ryzen uh, computer or PC as soon as it becomes available. And the plan is that I'm going to take you guys along for the journey while I go through it too. And that is basically what I'm calling my project The Road to Ryzen. Now, this video and this series isn't really going to highlight uh, what has changed with Zen for AMD. If you guys are interested in that, let me know in the comments below and I might make a video on that for you. So, all components should be arriving in the next few weeks and I'm planning on making some product overview videos in the meantime while we wait for Ryzen to become available. Sadly, I don't have early access to Ryzen. I'm just a normal consumer like you guys. And well, I'll have to wait until it's available in stores. Also, all my components are paid uh, from my own pocket, no sponsors for me. So, I'm hoping you'll embark with me on this Road to Ryzen project of mine, and let's see how well AMD's new Zen Ryzen processor does against a 3-4 to four year old Haswell i7-4770K. I'll be doing both benchmarks stock and overclocked. My i7 4770K runs at about 4.5 GHz using an all-in-one water cooler. And well, we'll have to see what I can overclock the Ryzen to. Good note, what benchmarks would you like to see? I have some in mind, but let me know in the comments below what you would like me to test. And well, that's it. Give the video a like if you're also interested in AMD Ryzen, and maybe subscribe for future videos to, well, join along and see how well it does. And again, if you have any burning questions or you idiot, you must test this first, otherwise the world is going to do end in an apocalypse of CPU power struggles or whatever. Whatever the case, just let me know in the comments below and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.